when we meditate, it's food for the mind. As the Buddha said, there are three things that nourish the mind. There's contact with the senses and awareness of the senses, and then there's our intentions. And the intentions are the important things. If we feed the mind with good intentions, it becomes a healthy mind. You look at your actions, you look at your intentions, and there's nothing to criticize that gives you a sense of well-being, a sense of, sense of inner worth, which is what bunya or merit is all about, that sense of inner worth. That we live on this earth and we're not just taking, taking, taking when we can. We think about the other people around us. In the sense that we want to make sure that our happiness doesn't cause any harm to anybody else. So take a good look around you. When you look for happiness, what, what, are the imp what is the impact that it has on other people? If you see that you're causing harm, well, you can change, because that, kind of, that kind of food for the mind is this, it's the kind of food that saps your strength. You get a little bit of pleasure, but there's nothing left after the pleasure is gone, nothing good left. Just more hunger, and then there's the karma of having harmed others. So you want to make sure that your happiness is good all around. And that gives nourishment to the mind. It gives you a sense of well-being, a strength inside. This is why the Buddha placed conviction in the power of your action as one of the first strengths that keeps the mind strong. Because otherwise you do things and you tell yourself it doesn't really matter, but after a while it begins to pile up and you begin to see that it does matter. So make sure that when you look for happiness, you're looking in the right way. Look for happiness that will keep you strong over time. That's real, the real good food for the mind. We do that by being generous, by being virtuous, by meditating. All the things that are really good for the mind. So look for your food here. Look for your happiness here, inside, in, in an area where it doesn't harm anybody at all. And when you find this happiness, you'll find that you'll have more to share. Like a person who's strong and then uses that strength to help other people. It's something that's good all around. <laughs>